Hey guys, welcome back to the vlog. It is Saturday, February 6th. We are about to go dump, finally. We waited a whole extra week again. The black tank did just fine. We can store a lot more in that <laughs> than we thought. We actually just got up this week's video today, and I've been trying to get it up since Thursday, but for some reason, it wasn't exporting from Premiere Pro, and it's because Premiere Pro did an update. They changed the export settings, and they made this one particular part to a higher degree and we always take it up as high as you can go and we didn't realize that they took it up even higher so we usually go to like a hundred on that part but we were going up to 250 so it wasn't exporting it didn't have like the capacity to do it and it took us only three times trying when it was taking about eight hours to export every single time and then after two times of trying for eight hours each, so 16 hours in total, we figured out what the problem was and we were able to export it and then upload it to YouTube finally. But I'm pretty proud of it. I think it's a pretty good vlog. And hopefully this one will be a good vlog for you guys too and have some action packed adventure and excitement in it. Let's go guys. We are finally on the road. I don't know if you just saw that back out process, but we were running really smoothly. And Chris was already like halfway into the road when somebody decided to pull out onto the street. And then when they saw Chris, he was already in the road. They just started honking their horns at him, like pull back in and let us go. The freaking nerve of people, I swear. <laughs> He says, my dad is out there. Hey guys, so it is a week later now <laughs> since we've last seen you. Oh, hello. Yes, <laughs> it is. <laughs> and um, I'm doing something a little crazy today. Go get my septum pierced. <laughs> it's like oh, this part right here. It's my nose. I already have my nose pierced once, so who cares? But yeah, so I'm a little nervous. I'm not gonna lie. Decided this that I wanted to do this Thursday night around like 12 a.m. when Chris was sleeping and we tried yesterday to go but apparently like piercers don't work on Fridays or something because all the shops near us were um, like they're they were all out they were all out, <laughs> they were all out of piercers <laughs> um, but no now I there is one out the place where I've gotten a few I got a couple tattoos done at this place so I'm pretty confident it's a girl, which always makes me feel more comfortable with like a female, you know. 
I'm a girl's girl. So I decided I want to do this. I figured who really cares right now during the pandemic, everybody's wearing masks anyways. I'm at home most of the time. Um, if I don't like it, it's on the inside of my nose. I can just take it out, you know, and if I do like it, then awesome. And I do really like that on other people. So I'm excited to do it myself. So I think I'm just gonna stop talking now and we're gonna cut to me getting it done. Ah! Now does this go through like cartilage or? It's not supposed to. Okay. So I'm pulling out on it, so hopefully we don't hit that car crash. I know, I'm so sorry. It's really uncomfortable. My eyes are Yeah. Okay, all I need to do is a big deep breath all the way in and pull it all the way out. Good girl. Oh, yeah, no, that was nothing. Huh? Yeah, and that didn't go through your <laughs> Okay, so I'm just going to stick this little there. Okay. And I have to kind of pull on you, so I'm sorry. Okay. Just get it lined up. And then we're gonna pull, okay? Mm-hmm. You'll probably bleed a little bit. I did okay. poke a hole in you. Just gonna put a little bead on it, okay. and then I'll clean up my mess. That was really nothing. You did a great job. Thank you. <laughs> I've been doing this a while. Yeah. So. That's good to know. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Guys, bear with me. This thing You're is fine. tiny, okay? You're fine. Okay, hey guys, so I have my septum pierced now. <laughs> when we were leaving, Chris was Chris was talking about how he really wants a tattoo, and she said, I have some time later. And so Chris set up the appointment, and we're going back now <laughs> for Chris to go get a tattoo. This is such like a random fun day. They don't have a lot of people there, so it's like pretty COVID friendly. It smells like a doctor's office when we're in there. And the last time we were in there, there was only like three other people, so no worries. And I was in a private room when I got this done, and I only took my mask down here, and everybody else was wearing masks, so I feel comfortable. Um, I'm gonna get a jellyfish, something I've wanted for a while. Yeah, he sticks to the nautical themes. Lighthouse, I got the palm tree, palm trees, I got a skull. Yeah, but he's uh, gonna be adding it. Yeah, and then uh, he has a quote from his favorite band, which is like a reggae band. So, and then I got Jack Sparrow tattoo. <laughs> yep, you have Jack Sparrow's tattoo, the um, sparrow, yeah, the sparrow, yeah, the sparrow that with like the um, the sunset in waves. the ocean waves, yeah. So now he's gonna add a jellyfish. jellyfish. Okay, guys, we'll go ahead and cut to the next clip then of Chris getting his tattoo done. <laughs> Excited? Let's see. Let's go. I just have to do the shading next. It looks so good. As you just saw, our Jeep is going to the doctor, finally. It needs a new engine and it's it's been about a year since it's it's been running, so we're excited to get that thing going. But that'll be it for this week's vlog, guys. Go ahead and subscribe and like the video. We'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.